What's going on guys, it's Dio here with Return of Dio Gaming and Real Life Writing here on YouTube. And uh, this is something people have asked me to do a bit before. Um, I kind of did it when I first got my GoPro with a live comm, but um, do a commentary over Real Life Writing instead of video games. So um, the main thing about this is if you look above this video, as soon as it's posted, when the next video goes up, this won't be in effect, but this is in fact my 300th video. So that is awesome. Um, so kind of doing this as special because I, I don't really know what else I can do. Um, if you take a look right there on the screen and I look back again, that's Cody behind me. Uh, 450 rider. He doesn't race. If he did, he'd easily be 450 pro um, mid to front pack. Um, just giving you an idea. Um, we're, we're pretty good friends. He was out there pushing me around. If you watched my triple camelback video, he's the one that um, kind of encouraged me to hit that and helped me out with that. Um, Really cool guy though, really good rider, and uh, he was just pushing me around. So that's what these laps are. Um, after after it, I told him that it was probably the hardest that I rode in a few months, um, trying to keep him behind me. And then the next lap, I let him go first, and I try to keep up with him. Um, but yeah, anyway, so this is kind of a 300th video. Um, I, I don't know if you can call it a special, but I don't know what else I can even do. You know, uh, I'm not gonna spend money to go make a different video. And you guys have seen my setup, you've seen my face. Um, there's nothing I can really like just wow you guys with so I hope this is okay um, what I do want to do though is uh, questions and answers um, someone was asking about it before so I figured you know why not might as well go with it see if anyone else is interested in it um, so ask your questions I'll answer them in a later video I'm not sure when but not too long maybe give you guys a week to put in your questions and you can leave that in the comments here you can tweet them to me you can uh, leave them on my Facebook uh, those are definitely the three best ways to do it, and if you don't mind, if you could keep it actual, uh, blue that line there, that's a bummer, but uh, at least Cody's still behind me, I am i know he could have passed me, um, I'm not taking anything away from him, I know he could have, um, he was just trying to push me and play cat and mouse with me, but um, if you could keep it to questions that like are actually interesting to me, <laughs> like if you ask about me, I know that sounds so cocky and arrogant, but I don't want people asking like, how do you install the skins on MXS? That's not exactly what I mean with a questions and answers video, but anyway. Um, coming around that left hand sweeper at the top of the hill there, I kind of got a little gnarly up, tucked my friend in a bit and cut across the track. That's why I looked back at Cody and took a risk there <laughs> jumping next to that dude. I, I didn't know if that was going to play out. Um, I saw there were three of them. I didn't know how close they were. I didn't even know who all they were. Um, luckily, I didn't land on anyone or have someone come across. Let's probably not a smart move to do on a practice day with random people out on the track like that but uh i don't know sometimes you just got to do especially when you're getting pushed by a friend like that uh you don't want him to pass you so it's just like a normal race um here you can see uh, i'm just waiting up for him um you probably won't be able to hear this especially because i'm talking but you couldn't hear it over the bikes anyway but he was like got a little sketch back there and i was like yeah and then we just took off again um Again, keep in mind, he's on a 450, I'm on a 125 that's actually been bored out to a 134, but um, yeah, they, they changed up Aztec a bit, I know I post a lot of videos from Aztec and people are like, wow, you must really like Aztec. Well, first off, yeah, I like Aztec a lot. Second off, it's about a 25 minute drive for me, um, I get free practice out there now. Uh, the other track that I'd even want to go to is Lakewood where the National is, and that's about, I don't know, maybe a 70 to 90 minute drive, um, and it's going to cost money. and gas is expensive and uh, actually a lot of people who live up in Denver don't even like the track so that's why I ride so much Aztec and they switch it up every every few weeks they'll change a little section and so it's kind of nice to have at least something fresh um, this whole side of the track the north side is all the same but the south side was changed up some and uh, pretty soon here in two or three weeks they actually put in a new section if you follow me on Twitter and Instagram you would have seen the picture of it it's a double 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 on one side and a triple triple on the other side like it's split um, I'm really excited to see how it plays out it they redid the whole south side um, the south end of the track I've, obviously I'll have videos of that when that is up and in effect um, and uh, as you can see through this I did the helmet cam I know a lot of people were asking for it it was aimed better uh, earlier in the day I'll have a lapse video up after this a uh, normal not the, these laps uh, laps from earlier in the day and uh, the helmet was aimed a little better, I don't know what happened here that I aimed it so bad, but oh well, this guy 
takes my line and then doesn't even take the line and screws me. But last lap, Cody got screwed by those um, people we were passing, so it's only fair that I got screwed back. And then he pulled off there, so we just did those two laps with each other real quick. Um, like I said, probably the hardest pushed, hardest I've pushed in a long time. Uh, always fun to have someone like that on the track with you. So like I said, he pulled off, um, so then I wrapped back around to this part of the track. I just pulled off and came back here to just kind of do some sections and stuff. But uh, that about wraps it up for this video. Um, I'll just show you this part through here real quick. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and like I said, I, I want to do a questions and answers video, so ask your questions here on Twitter at D-O-D-E-E-O 991. Uh, Facebook, that's slash backslash whatever it is, facebook.com slash uh, return of D-O. You can ask your questions there um, in the comments of these on Twitter, and I'll try my hearts to get around all of them. Uh, hopefully there's a good amount. Hopefully it's more than like six, but if there's anything that you want to know about me that I haven't answered in the past and never alluded to, let me know, and um, I'll answer it. And if you ask really stupid things or illegal things, I'm not going to answer them because it's just silly. <laughs> anyway, thanks a ton for watching, guys. Thanks for sticking around for 300 videos. Um, I doubt most of you were here for all 300 because uh, my first ones were super shitty, but uh, thanks for sticking around for the past 100 at least or whatever. It um, means a lot. So until next time, guys, take it easy. If it's easy, take it twice. I'll talk to you later.